Hey, let's talk about temporary credentials, a new feature available in private preview in 10.2 in September 2023. I'm Sarah Zinger, and I'm an engineer on the AWS Data Sources Squad at Grafana Labs. So what problem does temporary credentials solve? Well, currently when configuring a CloudWatch data source plugin uh, in Grafana Cloud, you are required to generate an AWS user and then create uh, long-term credentials for that user, and then share those credentials with Grafana. Best practices for security dictate that those secret keys should be rotated on a regular basis since they never expire, which means you have to rotate them in AWS, and then you have to update them in Grafana, which we know is an arduous task, and that means that this step is often skipped. To improve this experience, we're releasing a private preview of our new temporary credentials feature. With temporary credentials, rather than generating a long-term user, all you need to do is create an IAM role, which Grafana will assume and query for data on your behalf. Those credentials will expire then on their own. You'll no longer have to rotate keys. So how does it work? Let me show you. First, get support at Grafana to enable the feature for you. Once the feature toggle is enabled, you'll see a new drop-down option under Authentication Provider in your CloudWatch configuration. Select Grafana Assume Role. Then you'll see some instructions on how to create an IAM role for Grafana to assume. This IAM role will do three things. The first is that it's going to establish a trust relationship with, AW, uh, with Grafana's AWS account. Next, it's going to have a conditional statement, which says that it will only work if Grafana passes along an external ID that represents your account. Finally, this IAM role needs permissions to access CloudWatch so that we can query your data for you. Once you've created the role, you just need to copy the ARN and paste it here in the configuration. You select a region, and you're good to go. This feature is in private preview, and we're actively looking for customers who are interested in testing this feature and sharing their feedback with us. Prior to general availability, we intend to continue to improve the UI and respond to any feedback users share with us. It is our intention to also eventually roll this functionality out to all AWS data source plugins. This feature is included in cloud plans for free. Talk to your Grafana rep or the Grafana support team to learn more and test this feature out today.